Hello Needham, I'm Ben Gilman here to tell you what's happening in town this week throughout the month of June and beyond. From special events to ongoing programs, all that and more right here on the Community Bulletin Board. The Needham Farmers Market is coming back for its 13th season. Opening day will be Sunday, June 16th and most Sundays after that from 11 a.m. to 3 p.m. This year, the Farmer's Market will be back at Garrity Way in front of Town Hall, as well as on the Town Common. It features fresh local produce, different goods, live music, and family-friendly activities. For a list of vendors, go to needhamfarmersmarket.org. Summer is right around the corner, and so is the opening day of the pools at the Rosemary Recreation Complex. The soft opening is Saturday, June 15th and Sunday, June 16th, with the grand opening on Saturday, June 22nd. Memberships are available at the Park and Rec website. For questions, call 781-455-7930 or email parkandrecreation at needhamma.gov. One Wing Gateway East is hosting some events to showcase its newest property. Both of these will be held at the main building located at 235 Gould Street. First, on Tuesday, June 18th, is a model open house from 1 to 3 p.m. Then, on Thursday, June 20th at 2, meet author Dave Wedge, who's written books about Tom Brady, Whitey Bulger, and John Lennon. To register, call 781-328-6699 or email sales at wingateliving.com. The Town of Needham will host a Juneteenth celebration on Wednesday, June 19th, starting at 9.30 a.m. on the Town Common in front of Town Hall. Join your neighbors as well as local, state, and federal leaders for a recitation of the Emancipation Proclamation and more. All are welcome to attend. Juneteenth is a federal holiday that commemorates the ending of slavery in the U.S. The next Paint and Recycle Day at the Recycling and Transfer Station will be Saturday, June 15th, with the next one scheduled for July 20th. Needham residents with a current RTS sticker can bring old cans of paint between 8 a.m. and 3.30 p.m. The Reuse It Swap Shop will be closed during these hours and no drop-offs will be accepted. Time for a break, but don't go anywhere. The CBB will be right back. Imagine always being front row to plays like this. Always coming up with it. I'm oh, front have a goal. Yeah! Woo! Or this. Oh, 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 oh. And even this. Hoppy oh, gets the corner and he gets around the whole corner. And man, he could go all the way. Being able to capture high school sports at their highest level. Chmielewski under it, and the Rockets are the state champion! The Needham Rockets have done it again! A three-peat! Here at the Needham Channel, you can do all of those things and more. Plus, we definitely have our fun here, too. Interested? We'd love to hear from you. Send us an email at sports at needhamchannel.org or visit our website, needhamchannel.org, for more information. Hi, everybody. It's Matt Robinson, the host of the Writer's Block here on the Needham Channel. Uh, it's a local show where we interview authors from all over the place about interesting topics and the process of writing. If you're an author or want to become one, we hope you'll join us on the Needham Channel and NeedhamChannel.org. On Thursday, June 20th at 7 p.m., the Library Foundation of Needham will be hosting a game night in the community room. It will be hosted by game designer Gene Mackles, who has worked on shows for WGBH, NBC Sports, HDTV, and more. Gene's games will be available for exploration and enjoyment, and you are welcome to bring your own as well. To register, go to the library's website. The annual summer reading program at the Needham Public Library will soon kick off. Kids and young adults can log their reading times online or in a physical log distributed by the Needham Library. Readers up to age 12 get a free book and a pass to use at the Constitution Museum when they sign up. 
Children and young adults ages 12 to 18 can win prizes for reading and will automatically be entered into raffles for grand prizes. Registration is now opened and logging will begin on June 25th. The Needham Council on Aging will be holding free programs located at the center of the Heights at 400 Hillside Ave. The first is Monday, June 17th at 10 a.m. Coffee with Norfolk County Register of Deeds, William O'Donnell. On Tuesday, June 18th at 1 p.m., come learn about self-care strategies for elder orphans. On Thursday, June 20th at 1 p.m., musical lecturer Frank King presents singer-singer Joe Stafford. Finally, Friday, June 21st, between 10 a.m. and 2 p.m., the Center of the Heights will be holding a shredding event with D.A. Morrisley. For more information or to register, call 781-455-7555. The MBTA will be doing maintenance work over the next month to support a positive train control, a federally mandated safety system. As a result, shuttle buses will replace trains on the Needham commuter rail line on the following days. Friday, June 28th, Saturday, June 29th, Sunday, June 30th, and Monday, July 1st. The buses run between Needham Heights and Forest Hills with stops at or close to the Needham commuter rail stations. Time for another break, but don't go anywhere. The CBB will be right back. The Needham Channel is a community-based television organization that pretty much covers everything in Needham. We cover a lot of different municipal meetings like town meetings, select board, school committee, a lot of high school sporting events up at Needham High School, basketball, football, baseball, lacrosse, soccer, pretty much everything. We have a live newscast every Thursday night and we pretty much cover a lot of different events with a lot of different organizations and we're also here for anyone who's interested in learning about television to learn about television. A volunteer here at the Needham Channel can really expect to learn about anything they want. Whether it's being on camera, being behind the camera, learning how to edit, really anything involved in the creative process of television, it's really only hampered by their own imagination and creativity. What really makes the Needham Channel special is the people. Whether it be the people out in the community that we work with or our staff, it's really just an amazing experience. Check out the Needham Channel on social media for all the latest news, sports, and events happening around town. Follow the Needham Channel, Needham Channel News, and Needham Channel Sports on Facebook and Twitter. Also, follow the Needham Channel on Instagram and YouTube. Get connected with the Needham Channel on social media. Town buildings are now observing their summer hours. Town Hall and the Public Services Administration Building are open at 8, Monday through Friday, and close at 5 on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Thursdays, 6 on Tuesdays, and 12.30 on Fridays. The Rosemary Recreation Complex offices have the same hours with Park and Rec 8.30 a.m. to 5 p.m. The library is open 9 to 9, Monday through Thursday, 9 to 5.30 Friday, 9 to 5 Saturday, and 1 to 5 Sundays. The recycling and transfer station is still 7.30 to 4, Tuesdays through Saturday, except Fridays when it closes at noon. The Center of the Heights is open at 8.30 Mondays through Fridays, closing at 5 on Mondays and Wednesdays, 8 on Tuesdays and Thursdays, and 3 on Fridays. Make sure you're signed up for the town's 911 system. Residents and businesses will receive emergency alert notifications to their phone, email, or landline for info related to an evacuation, shelter in place, protective measures, and much more. Sign up at the Smart 911 website on your screen. Have you checked out our news website, NeedhamLocal.org? A service of the Needham Channel, Needham Local is the newest part of our foundation to provide local news coverage to the town. You can check out our latest stories at needhamlocal.org and while you're there, scroll down to the right side of the screen and sign up for our weekly newsletter. It sends the top stories of every week, every Monday at 1. Would you like to submit an announcement at no cost for the Needham Channel Community Bulletin Board? Interested people and nonprofit organizations can send an email to cbb at needhamchannel.org. Thanks for joining us on this week's edition of the Community Bulletin Board. We'll see you around Needham.